we have here the Emotion V10F on V11 the difference are a lot of difference between them and this is my experience since I've got them it's like three weeks with them second day with the wheel I'm feeling a little bit better than yesterday and one thing I really noticed is I just put more eye on the wheel in the wheel and it feels a little bit more steady this is 27 kilograms versus 17 this is a big difference because when you want to carry them it's not the same hanging this it's not easy at all and we have here the beaten it it's not a big deal to carry this one but I have to say the best thing from the B10 it's not the weight it's it's a possibility to uh, put a case on it I don't know how to tell it but when you are starting you fall down a lot all the time I'm on the floor I'm not falling down but the, the wheel is just going to the floor and and it's better with the case because the body is protected I guess I never remove it since I bought it I never remove it the the pads are really scratched but what I really care is the body because it's wow it's dirty but I cannot see scratches anywhere but it's not a big it's not really big it's kind of kind of small and here comes the first problem I have with the V11 you cannot protect anywhere if you try to put some protection some places it's impossible it's a lot of scratches everywhere and this is carbon fiber also this is aluminium and I will show you closer because this is my first problem with this okay I show you here this is aluminium and all of this is a scratch and I try to paint to look all the scratches we have here everywhere um, <laughs> if you are starting like me I completely recommend B10 or B8 and put a very good case on them because you are going to destroy the wheel this, uh, this option it has suspension in difference at that one but I have to tell you don't trust with the suspension a lot because if you go really fast like more than 20 kilometers per hour and you try to jump something or, or a place that you know the suspension need to work you never know how it's going to react the suspension sometimes it goes faster and you just jump on the wheel and you fall down and other times it's really nice because a small small rocks on the on the way it helps a lot because you don't feel that those and here it tells you what kind of pressure you have to put in the under the suspension to help you to regulate your weight but uh, it's on the top where you must to adjust and that's really really complicated it's not working really well another problem is when you fall down the first thing touch the floor it's the suspension tube and scratch a lot it's I, I, it's not possible to see now because I just clean it and paint it but yeah it's I will show you in some photos but uh, you save 500 euros and use the 10F it's lighter 
it's easiest to start you can to protect it and I don't know the range from this one it's like a hundred kilometers against 60 or 70 today I'm going to test how many kilometers I can do with a B10F and the speed it's 55 against 40 in my opinion I was not able yet to try more than 30 kilometers per hour because my limit on the both wheels is 29 and I try to not go faster because my experience don't let me go on that fast and yeah I think it's 29 you can fall and hurt yourself a lot I think until you get more than 500 or 300 kilometers don't don't go more than that and this is my experience with both of these wheels I'm going to sell this one on internet because I don't want it I don't like the suspension I don't like how it works I don't like not have the chance to protect it and it's not for me but if you have a lot of experience you don't fall down you want comfort and maybe this one is for you but it's any of that is for me I don't want comfort because I'm just learning and it's for me not a big deal I don't want the suspension because I prefer know exactly how it's going to react the wheel sometimes you just need to put your body ready for the jumps or anything you find in the way and I don't know it's a really nice wheel it's carbon fiber aluminium the light is amazing when you open the light on the night it's everything you can see everything in front of you another thing good from the other one is the music Also the lights, I never seen before the lights because I'm using the case all the time and uh, I never seen this. And when you turn off the the wheel, the radio, the music is still on. And this is kind of fun because you can use it in a party or something, but the music is not really good quality. What, what is good is you have a front speaker in front and another one in the back side and when you are on the wheel you can feel a kind of a stereo around you but whatever these are my experience with I will show you some videos from both of them this one is too heavy for me for starting the, the side I can tell you the when you are on the wheel in the B10F you are here on the V10 and the V11 you are like the V10F you can feel a little bit closer to the floor and you feel better the V10 11 it's good for off-road because there is rocks or anything on the road if your pads are higher you don't touch the floor as easy as the thin V10 and um, this is it. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.
duración 2 horas 2 minutos 48 segundos ritmo 4 minutos 2 segundos por kilómetro 